Welcome back. Now we're heading to a place that provides comfort and care to children and their families. The Ronald McDonald House of Long Island has 18 bedrooms and has been completely revamped with the help of top leaders in the interior design industry. It's all part of Project Design 2013. Take a look. Hi, I'm Tony Barada, and welcome to the Designer Show House at the Ronald McDonald House of Long Island in New Hyde Park, New York. Over 30 local designers have brought their unique vision to transform this house. There's a lot to see, so let's go check it out. I'm Jamie Drake from Drake Design, and for my room here at Ronald McDonald House, I wanted to create something that was warm, upbeat, and serene. The large, bold accent wall has horizontal stripes that are quite dramatic. The curtains are a striped fabric, but a much smaller scale, going vertically. And then we have art that's a striped sort of arc, an almost contemporary rainbow. We all have the same program, a furniture that needed to be included in the room. I chose very soft, embracing forms with a lot of curves, like this wonderful, comfortable lounge chair. The desk chair also has a great form that embraces you. And the headboards, even though rectilinear, are soft and comfortable. This is a wonderful project to be involved with. All the designers were here to create a sense of hope and positivity here at Ronald McDonald House. And I chose to do it with my rainbows and runways to the future. I'm Matthew Patrick Smythe, and at this year's Designer Show House, I did the New York Mets room. My goal for this room was to create a room that is about the Mets, of course, but it's also a room that you don't have to be a baseball lover to enjoy. One of the first things I found was this carpet, and it really anchors the room, it really sets it off, and it's, you know, the message is there right away. One of the challenges I had with this room was to create some architecture. I just didn't want long expanses of blank wall. So I added these three quarter inch strips around the room just to define the spaces, to enclose the banners, and to um, highlight them a little bit better. I created these two bookcases to enclose the television set. And then in the middle here, I connected them with this wainscoting, but instead of doing traditional wainscoting, I added these baseball diamonds. And then on the other side of the room, I balanced it again with more baseball pants. And then for the Roman shades, I found this wonderful fabric, which I was very lucky to find, which is baseball stripes. Well, this concludes my tour of the New York Mets room at the Ronald McDonald House. I had a lot of fun designing this, and I look forward to seeing the families enjoy it also in the future. Hi, I'm Yang Ha, an interior designer in New York, and I designed this family suite. Let's take a closer look. The first thing we chose was this curtain fabric from Marameco called Onin Omampu, which means in Finnish, tree of childhood happiness. We chose this chair designed by Saarinen called the Wound Chair. We think it's aptly named. We made sure to make the desk modern and playful because we envisioned children sitting there and doing their homework. We think white is healing, so we made sure that this room was painted in an envelope of white. On this wall, we have shelves coming out of the black lines, giving some dimensionality and some playfulness where we can hang some fun art. In contrast to the black lines here, in the bathroom, we use the rounded shapes of the Trianale tile designed by Gio Ponti that are shaped like jigsaw puzzles. I hope you enjoyed viewing my designs for this family suite. So stop by, it's for a great cause, and you might pick up some design tips for your own home.